Best of five between Determined and EG. I'd like to welcome the Walking Zed's mid laner, Bishu, to the studio. Welcome. Thanks for coming. Thank you for inviting. It's great to be here, Shox. Well, um, of course, I, you're playing tomorrow, but I'd like to pick your brain on this matchup specifically because you know these teams so well, especially the challenger teams. What are your impressions of that first game? Um, I honestly think it's a little surprising because I scrimmed, uh, we are T the Walking Zed, I scrimmed against both EG and T uh, to be determined now, determined gaming. And I honestly thought they would destroy EG. I've, I was very unimpressed a little bit. Um, if you'd have to pick a certain lane matchup that you thought would go very much in favor of the other, what, what surprised you the most? I guess, uh, I guess it would be a little surprising with mid lane. I mean, obviously Arsenal didn't even go mid. And honestly, I thought when <laughs> Arsenal might have just gone window mid because he does some crazy stuff, right? But I think, I think West Rice could have uh, even destroyed Six a little harder. I was kind of sad to see them just get pressure so hard. How much do you think that uh, it's an influence on the play of Determined that Westry seem to want to keep playing those assassins? Uh, obviously, right now it's a really tanky top meta. Um, I guess they get kind of covered that with Mundo. But I feel like just having no magic damage really hurt them. And uh, it's a little bit tolling to the team by not going those uh, champions that really help the team right now. So um, the German gaming up against EG and you guys tomorrow are going to be up against Team Coast. I maybe want to start by asking that uh, they picked you guys as the second, uh, the second team to be picked. If you could pick, who would you want to be up against and why? We would pick, probably pick EG because obviously, and first of all, it's Coast, Coast made a mistake by just picking us because we are obviously going to destroy them and, <laughs> you know, they're just going to lose their LCS spot. <laughs> Wrong choice. I see that you're already preparing to be in the LCS, a little trash talk here and there, but, but seriously, your matchup in the mid lane is going to be up against Shifter. How do you think that's going to go? Uh, Shifter, I, honestly, I really respect Shifter a lot. He, uh, he taught me how to play the, the game quite a bit too, but I feel like as a team though, we have much better synergy, so uh, we're not, I'm not afraid. This is, I think it's going to be great. <laughs> um, yeah, it's going to be a fun matchup. Talking about that synergy that you hit right there, you guys are actually quite a young team. Can you kind of road us through your personal history with the team? Uh, yeah, we originally were a team called GG Los Angeles and we're a team about two months ago, but we've had some roster changes and now we had this, uh, the roster right now for only a month. So we're pretty proud to be where we are right now. We're really good friends and it's, it just feels great to that, uh, you know, just like five friends creating a team and just being here right now and having a chance to become an LCS team. Absolutely, because only a month old and then we kind of saw that Quantic were very favored to, to be here, maybe complexity a little bit earlier on. Why do you think that is that it was kind of a changing in the of the guard in that challenger scene? Uh, it was really unfortunate for Quantic because they were by far the strongest amateur team that NA has had so far. And it just shows. It just goes show that just one one off day could ruin your uh, hopes. It's honestly a little sad because uh, our team and a lot of other teams had high respect for Conte because they were really solid. And complexity was just another unfortunate case because uh, they obviously had some roster issues. So, but I think it's just uh, amateur scene is quite luck dependent in my opinion. Okay, yeah. so you think that'll be a big factor tomorrow? Are you nervous? Because you said you were quite nervous for this interview it tomorrow. It is quite <laughs> nerve-wracking, honestly. Uh, I, I streamed before, but it's nothing like this. And I, would, I wouldn't be this nervous tomorrow. Like, this is a lot more nerve-wracking well, no, nerve than it should be. <laughs> no, but you're doing great. Now, Thanks. as a final question, after that first game, how do you think the rest of the series is going to go? I still think uh, Determined Gaming will take the series. I, they, they've spent so much time as a team, and I respect them as a team. I, and I just really want to see them make it into LCS. All right. Well, thank you very much, and good luck tomorrow versus Team Coast, of course, Bishu. And now for the play-by-play -play of Game 2, let's end up...